Hey guys, and welcome back to Carrier. When we last left off, we was playing as Jessifer. Yes. Now, uh, I believe we've just reported uh, back to our friendo. I think reading my notes to what we actually did. Yeah, I think we went... Um, Unfortunately, didn't have many detailed notes. I think we've got to go back to the second engine room, if memory serves. We do have this locked door here, though. But I don't know if there's a way on the map where we can bypass it. Yeah, this one here. Door sensor is damaged. Doesn't look like the door will open. That's a pain in the butt. So we've got to go right back around the outside. Fingers crossed we can actually get through there. I'm sure that's where we've got to go to now. The second engine room. Because we did take the photos, if memory serves. And we did hand them back. Yeah. I'm guessing if we had the photos. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. These guys. Yeah, these weren't any threat, were they? So, these are like literally a waste of our time to even fight them. Now, I always prefer in games to fight the enemies, but there just doesn't seem to be any point. I wonder if we go in that door, actually. You know what? It's just fun. It's just fun to fight them. Fuck you guys. What was in here? I'm not sure if we even went in here, to be honest. We, I can hear walking around. Ah! Right. Well, I mean, there's enemies here, so... Oh, shit. We really don't have... a lot of... weaponry at all, do we? Hopefully. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. It's empty. Is that where we got the grenade launcher from? Uh, I guess so. Okay, well, let's take our welder for a walk for a while. I know we've got the grenade launcher. And I could swear that we've um, spoken to the dock. Because that's what I've got written here anyway. So, I must admit, I did kind of hastily write those notes. <laughs> it does, I've written it in a way it doesn't make sense. I'm wondering if it means that we need to go talk to the dog or that we already have. I know we took the photos. Uh, yeah, we did because he gave us that information. I remember. I remember stuff sometimes. And then we need to go up here. That's right. I'm sure he said something about engine room too. Unfortunately, there's no way of... Uh, third engine room. There's no way of actually finding out where you need to go. So if we go through here, sensor is damaged. Bullshit! Well, we don't like it when the sensor's damaged. God, this game feels so bizarre when it's running at its uh, full frame rate. It's so smooth. Ooh. Can we, go through? we can't go th We can go through here. Ooh. Okay. Oh. Now, I have no idea how good our welder is on this thing. Um, not very good. Apparently. Not very good at all. And I guess that's... To be, oh, that's our last health drink. Oh, dudes. Dudes, let's chalk this one up to an experiment, shall we? Can you actually kill one of these with a welder? You can. I mean, it's not a very efficient way of killing them, but I guess we could have just screwed ourselves over by doing that. Sensor's damaged. Shit, so we can't go through there. Oh, 
Okay. Unless we need to go to the second computer room, and I've put engine room down because I'm stupid. That could be what we need to do. Hmm. Oh, man, that was... That was kind of silly in a load of ways. I'm not sure how long we're going to be injured for. This injured state does seem to be kind of random. I guess they had to have that bit of uh, Resident Evilness in there. Only thing is, Resident Evil was a little bit more consistent with its uh, damage states. Right, let's have a look in here and see if we can do anything. All right, so this is the second computer room. Oh, the doctor's not here. There's a strange plant on the screen. So, I mean, that's the first computer room, which is weird. Uh... So, hmm. We def yeah, it, it, mm. I definitely wrote down that we need to go to that, but the door's locked. Is there a way? We, uh, why are you just running into nothing? Thank you. Yeah, there has to be a way we can get in there. Hmm. Um, is she really going to make that irritating, like, breathing sound all the way? Yeah, we can't go down that way because the door's actually blocked off. Um... Yeah, that, like, wounded <laughs> sound effect of uh, heavy breathing there, that's going to piss me off if that's actually, uh, if she's not going to recover from that. So, is, what is that? Weapons controller center. Yeah, we don't need to go there. We've already been in there. There's nothing we can do. Hmm. Now, obviously, there's nothing we can do with the plant. We haven't actually had any healing items up until this point. Either. So, we need to go into that door, correct? No. Not correct. We need to go into this door. This will lead us back into the Eve room. The nuclear core. And this is the third engine room. So, this is also the third engine room. So, the third engine room is a big boy. Okay. Right, there we go. Now, I can't remember what we actually have to do in here, but. At least we've made it in here. Spark team, please oh, respond. Okay. This is Lieutenant Manning. Manning, this is Sergeant Ingalls. Sergeant Ingalls, can you hear me? Your brother is alive. Yeah, I spoke to him on the radio. Good. I took some pictures of Ark and gave them to Dr. Noble. And the doctor gave me some information about Ark. Lieutenant, you saw it? What is it? Until I take a look at the data the doctor gave me, there's not much I can say. But it seems to have attached itself to the nuclear core. The nuclear core? How could... Yeah, it's hard to believe. I wonder what it is. I have to get this data back to headquarters and have it analyzed. Yeah, you're right. I just spoke to the doctor on the radio, but whatever it is, it seems to be much more dangerous than we thought. Yeah, this is some serious stuff. This Ark is not part of the Earth as we know it. I'm going to find the other members of my team that should be on the ship. I'll continue looking for survivors. Lieutenant, be careful. We don't know what's happening. Yeah, you too. 
Right, yeah, so <clears throat> we actually need to get to deck three living quarters. Right, if she's going to make this very irritating breathing sound, I might just reset the game. And uh, get back here, because we haven't actually done anything yet, so... This is going to really freaking irritate me. <laughs> Could they have made that any more obnoxious? I, I thought they got over that eventually. Do we? Yeah, we don't have any other healing. And we haven't found any other healing, I don't think, uh, thus far. So, right, I'm going to reset it, guys. I'll be back here in a second. Right, okay, so that's us back, and uh, uh, we've skipped all of that combat, because we don't need to do it. Right, so we need to get up to deck four, because we're on deck five, I believe. So we need to go up to deck four, and then... Ah, right. Can we go back through here? You know what I love about these kind of games, though? Like, when you're lost and you don't know where you're going, the game feels huge and... Uh, very time consuming. I thought as much. Yet, when you know what you're doing, the games are very short if you're just going point to point. Um, for instance, we're on 11 odd minutes. Uh, and I've just done about the first nine minutes of this video in about 30 seconds once I uh, realized where we're going. That's deck four. Years. So we can't take the red elevator yet, because we know that's the end. So, let's go. Get the hell out of here. Ah. Sandra, are there any survivors? This is... Sandra? Sandra? This is Jessifer. Jessifer, you came. Yeah. You okay? Where are you? I see. Boy, am I glad to hear your voice. This area is completely flooded. It's a mess. Wait, just a little bit more. I'll be there soon. Oh, yeah. Mark should be around here somewhere, too. He was investigating the Southern Cross Spy. Try to find him on your way here. Mm. Okay. Okay. No problem. Uh oh. What is the computer doing? Shutting all of the partitions down, I guess, Jessifer. That's pretty much what it just said. By order of Zoe. Oh, God. Well, you didn't think it was going to be that easy. Look at how small her waist is compared to, like, her legs. Her legs are... Dude, her... She's thick. Jesus. Okay. <laughs> I just noticed that with that camera angle. Man. That is a chunky model. Uh, was was Jack chunky like that too? I think it looks uh, different for her model because she's got this tiny waist. But the rest of her <laughs> is built the same as Jack. So it just looks funny. Uh, right, so um, we need to get to deck five. However, we're kind of shit out of luck. Hmm... I mean, that's disabled, so I guess... Oh, no, we can go this way. Okay. Oh, this is the main elevator. Well, there's nothing we can do out here, that's for sure. Right. Righty-tighty. Hmm. So, let's go to... I guess all of these partitions are going to be... Yeah, they're all locked up. Sensor is broken. We can't go that way at all. Well, I mean, I suppose uh, Jessica's area is a lot smaller. Which makes sense. Uh, no response. Uh, was, which deck was this? 
It makes sense if this is going to be like a smaller mode, or shorter mode, I should say, but I don't know if it actually is. Which deck was this? Right, we're on deck three. Okay. Oh, shit. That motherfucker's got a beard. At least it looks like he's got a beard. You know, we don't really have the ammo. Oh, God. Hello. We don't really have the ammo for those guys. Fucking creepers, man. Just slying in the corner there. Uh, luckily, the enemies in this game, like, really don't oppose you at all. You can just so easily just wander past them. Which uh, is fine, I guess. So, on my notes, I've also got Deck 3 Living Quarters. Ah, right. Oh, we've got Zambles. I can hear some Zambles coming our way. Now, mo oh god. Most of these rooms, we couldn't even look in before, if you remember. Everything seems normal. Oh, God. There's got to be some supplies or something around here. Please. Some handgun magazines, a grenade launcher. Oh, yeah. We already have the grenade launcher. But something that we can use, because we have really bingo supplies here. Uh, right. So, yeah. We're down to, like, 33 bullets. The door is damaged. It doesn't look like it opened. That's fucking bullshit right there. Oh, no. No. I guess the f first one. The first one was a lie. Um, I mean... Oh. I forgot we got the easy shooter. How much ammo do we have for that? Got a little bit. Alright. Can we go? Can we actually go in here? I mean, the gun is... Functionally the same. Is curious. Oh, I'm guessing there's gonna be like nothing in here. Yeah, nothing. Oh, that's such horseshit, guys. That is grade A horseshit. Um, doors damaged. Bollocks. Oh, come on, you dickhead. <laughs> There we go. Right, stick and move. Oh, son of a bitch. I guess we couldn't quite get out of the way quick enough. Is he dead? No. Soon fucking will be. <laughs> right, you're fucked, mate. Okay. Body is covered with wounds. Yeah. We don't want his wounds. We want the uh, rocket launcher in his pocket. Read into that what you will. Body's covered with wounds. Oh, man. I can't believe there's, like, no supplies. I mean, they went through the trouble of giving her her own weapon. Oof. Door is damaged. Yeah. Okay. I guess we're just gonna suck it up for now. 308. Yeah. I mean, I'm just searching these for the sake of it. I know 306. Ah. Alright, get out of it. Oh, God. Oh god, move, move, move. Not sure if we actually hurt each other or what there. Don't quite feel as bad about using the handgun here. Not knowing that I have uh, other weapons. 
Cool. All right. Nothing. Uh, okay. So, is there anything actually here at all? Nope. Why would there be? Okay. Yeah, we really don't want to tango with these zombies at all because we've got no health. We've got nothing left whatsoever. Bugger. Okay. It is what it is at this point, I suppose. This is just survival. Okay, 305 is out of action. Doors damaged. Yeah, there's a lot of um, rooms, I guess, that we don't even need to go into. Oh. Sergeant Ingalls. Lieutenant Manning. I'm glad to see that you're okay. Thanks. You too. How is the investigation going? Have you learned anything new? No, not yet. I still don't know what caused all this. Well, I have learned that if we don't shut down the weapons system on Deck 6, we won't be able to get out of here. Oh. What will we do? What indeed? Don't worry. I'll shut it down. Somehow. There's no one else you know. You're the only one who can do it. Mm -hmm. I have to get the data I received. From the doctor, back to headquarters, as soon as possible. You're right. Leave the ship to us. You should get out of here. Yeah. Have you heard from your brother? Yeah. I spoke to him on the radio. We'll meet up later. Good. I'm very grateful to your brother. He took care of me when I was unconscious. Oh, yeah. If you see him, tell him I said hello. <laughs> Will do. There's not much time. I must go. Here, take this. Jessica passes an energy drink to Jack. But Thanks. Be careful, Lieutenant. But we Thanks. We don't if have I any. If I learn anything new, I'll let you know. Uh, okay. Right. Okay. Uh, uh, we're going back the wrong way. Well, I mean... This one's flashing. I'm wondering if we actually have to go into that one. That might be the one we're looking for, to be fair. So, let's keep going anyway. Why not? We're on this path now. We might as well keep pushing. I can't believe we gave him an energy drink. He never gave us anything. God damn son of a bitch. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Ooh, safe spot. Uh, we should be okay for now. We are kind of close to our half an hour point, though. Uh, what the hell kind of accent was that? This is Operator Olympus calling Amdil. Is anyone there? Please respond. Olympus, this is Lieutenant Manning. Olympus, can you hear me? Olympus, please respond. There's too much static. If I don't get a hold of him... Ah, that's right! There was a transmitter on the deck. It's the only place I can transmit from. On the deck? Okay, so I guess we're gonna go back up to the deck then. All right, well, I mean, <laughs> silence. I mean, I guess that makes sense. No response from anywhere. Is there nothing in here whatsoever? I mean, already gone. Yeah, no shit. Half his body's already gone, Jessica. Jesus, woman. 
Okay, uh, so does that mean we can't like exp I'm guessing we can't explore this area anymore. Is that not going to open? Oh, it does open. Oh, wait, isn't this corridor completely blocked off, actually? There's a big gaping great big hole in the in the floor. Yeah. Oh, no! They've actually sorted that out. I guess. Ah. Of course, the sensor is broken, so that basically means we cannot go that way. We have to go back to the deck. Well, okay then. To the deck, we shall go. Now, unfortunately, we're just about out of time. But I suppose what we could do is go back to the main deck area, because there was a save room there. You know, we do have those T7 explosives, which we could probably be using a little bit more. Uh, just in the interest of saving a little bit of ammo, but I'm not 100% sure how effective they actually are. So maybe we need to research that. Maybe. Just maybe. I mean, hey. Blowing a motherfucker up is sometimes a good time in video games. You have to specify in video games these days. Otherwise, people assume you're some kind of crazy bomber or something. Um, now, let's go this way. And up and out. So, if we go up to the main deck. Uh, which was, hang on, where are we? Ah, oh, I'm guessing we can't go, th oh, we can go through here. Curious. The thing is, there's nothing really to find. Uh, I mean, okay. We can explore a little bit then. Where are we now? I don't think there's any point in exploring around, to be honest, because so far there's literally been nothing. I mean, there is a magazine around here somewhere. But, oh, yeah. Where was that magazine? There was one up here, wasn't there? Hmm. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. 24, 93. That's not good, really. not really that good at all. Why can't we replenish? Do you actually have to have the weapon equipped? I guess you do. It's a bit weird. Right, okay, so... Sure. Uh, maybe we shall investigate the magazine in the next episode then. Not sure if it's going to be worth it, though. Oh! Where the cock jockey have we gone to? Uh... Oh, we're in the nutbag room. Uh, right, guys. We've gone a wrong turn here. Dangling nut sacks and everything. Definitely don't be playing with balls today. Not if we can help it. Not mutated balls, anyway. Mm hmm. I'm going to go back through here. Man, this place is confusing. I mean, sure, some of the corridors are ever so slightly different colour. But, I mean, some are brown, some are grey, some are slightly pink, some are a bluey grey. Oh, Jesus wept. Tears of fucking blood. There we go. Oof, forgot about those guys. Interesting that they attacked us like twice, but it didn't register. Admittedly, I'm glad it didn't register, but I mean, come on. The enemy, <laughs> I've said it before, I've said it again. The enemies in this game are a joke. They're, they're a non-entity whatsoever, man. It's 
I kind of feel bad for them, you know? They, they never really had a chance. Anyway, I'm going to save this game here, guys. And when we return, uh, we're going to go to the deck, I suppose. Um, and see if we can radio the Olympus. So, God only knows what's going to come of that. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, 